Hi friends, welcome to my channel Civil Guru 04. Uh, today we have exercise number two for how to create a profile view. As you know, we have already created surface profile in the previous exercise number one, but we it was not generate uh, our profile view to see the surface profile. Uh, so we have some steps in this exercise. I will cover that immediately. Uh, before that, kindly subscribe my YouTube channel, Seval Guru 04, and uh, you can also access me through my Facebook page, Land Developer and Architect Designer. Here you can um, get many books and uh, everything about land surveying and AutoCAD Seval 3D also. So let's dive in the exercise. Uh, first of all, you know, in the AutoCAD Civil 3D software, you must use a profile view to display a profile of surface. A profile view is basically a grid that represents stations in the X direction and elevation in the Y direction. You will see in this exercise, the stations along the limit and their corresponding elevations are plotted on this grid and the resulting line represents changes in the terrain along the alignment. The profile view also includes various types of tables such as axis labels and axis titles to provide context to the display of the profile. Profile views can be further augmented with bands which will be covered in the next chapter uh, next chapter uh, displaying and annotations profile so in this exercise how to create a profile view uh, we will create a profile view to display the surface profile that we have created in the previous exercise so as we have already created surface profile, so we just need to show them in profile view. For that, you can use also same uh, drawing, but if you have not, then I am putting the link for download of this drawing in the description. So take your notebook and write down these some steps for this little exercise. Step number one, open the drawing name profile view. If you have not, you can use the previous exercise drawing or you can download that from the description link. Step number two, click the Jordan Court alignment because we were created the surface profile for this alignment of Jordan Court. Then click profile view. Step number three, in the create profile view, general dialog box create, click create profile view. Because we have already uh, the alignment name here. Sorry, uh, we have some alignments here and we can select anyone from them. So now we are going with Jordan code alignment. So as we have already selected that it's so we can put the name of alignment here also. I will leave that as it is. And click create profile view. Step number four, when prompted for the file view origin, click a point to open area. Here is the open area, so I want to click here. A new profile view is inserted in the drawing. You can see here we have grids for the profile view, and this red line is showing our surface profile of the chosen court alignment. So you can 
uh, see in the next chapter that how can we notate the profile views uh, to understand that better. As we have step number five, save the drawing and close it. So it was the little exercise that show you how to uh, add or how to create a profile view in your drawing. And in the previous exercise, you also see how can we generate surface profile. If we did not do that, we cannot access this profile view without exercise number one. Hope you like this video. Kindly subscribe and press the bell icon to get latest notification about civil 3D and land surveying videos.